Yeah, hello everyone and welcome back to the walkthrough. PK Gam here starting the Cave of No Return on level 1. And this is basically where I don't know anything about the game. Oh my goodness, it's so dark. So very dark. I'm just glowing lights and I see a lantern over there. I must get the lantern. Woo! And it becomes immediately light if I'm not mistaken. There we go. That's what I'm looking for. Yeah, I don't really care about those kinds of dark sections because you can't really see anything anyway. So, yeah. So, let's just, uh, yeah, when you got the lantern, you can automatically brighten up the whole screen, like, just where you need it. Just where the camera needs it, I should say. And, uh, so that works out pretty nicely for me, I gotta say. What the heck? That force gem just came out of the ceiling. And I will light these torches, if you don't mind. Thank you. Shadow Link, I will destroy you. Yeah! Ooh, ooh. Oh, I failed to destroy you. And... Ooh. Yay for force gems! Whoa, big zoom out here. That's, that's kind of weird. Uh, yeah, the camera zooms out on occasion to show you the area of which you're going into. For a big force gem, it's a hundred. And... Uh, I'll, I'll just completely ignore that one. Oh, I bet you it's this one. Yep, because there's a little dark spot on the floor. That spot is stained. I'm going to... Push one of these, one, oh wait, I bet you it's these three. No, not those three. Is it that one? Is it that one? Ah, uh, wait, 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 I bet you it's actually that one, then, then this one. There we go, okay. Treasure chest for the win. And continue on through the cave of no return. That fire looks kind of dangerous there. So I'm just going to, wait, can I, am I supposed to like push them? No, I would doubt that. Oh, wait, or maybe I am supposed to go like, oh, okay. And don't touch the fire. The fire is hot, I would bet. I would think that the fire would burn you just a little bit if you were to touch it. But I, I, I'm not wishing to, uh, you know, try that experiment. It did seem to scorch this floor pretty well. And I got a small key. Let's go take it to a keyhole. Which I didn't even know there was a locked door to. Because as I said, this is going to be like semi-blind. Because I don't even remember what I'm supposed to do here. Um, am I supposed to, I bet you I have to push it like this, break those, and pull it back and push it down. No, I can't pull it back. I hope I didn't screw myself there. I don't think I did, because I don't think I could have pushed it. No, I couldn't have pushed it anyway. So, uh, I guess I'm, I can't, I can only push those two squares or something. Well, whatever. Well, I'll just leave it like that then, and reset. I mean, reset the characters. 24 gems for the win, and do it. Do I want out of here? There we go. That will pick up those pots. Not actual pot kids. Do not do pot. And you know, don't, don't just don't follow Yoshi's example. Let's try and kill the rat before it kills us. I want the square. Thank you. Oh, I need to get rid of the pots first. Yeah. And open says me. Oh, I need to be like that. I need to be controlling only one character to open treasure chest. I don't know why, but whatever. And I got the small key. Yeah. Wait, doesn't that open the door off to that side? Yeah, it does. So I'm just gonna. Yuppa. Kululimpa. And open through here. Oh, these are colored blocks. You need, like, you need to push those blocks, like, individually with each character. Like, each character can only push their own block, and holy cow, the camera is really screwing up. I'm not going to do that often. <laughs> I would prefer not to do that. I, I hope that won't be a problem there in this uh, walkthrough. But I guess we shall see, huh? Uh, but I guess you could see what I was doing there anyway. Is it purple and green block? So I'll push the green one because I'm controlling the green dude. Yay! And purple. I'll push that. No, I can't push it like that. That's weird. So, red block. Can't push that one for some reason. Pink block. And that one I could push. No, oops. Let's try the blue one over here. You guys get out of my way. Thank you very much. And treasure chest. And... Yeah, baby, we're making progress. We're making progress here. And open the treasure chest. Oh, 200 force gems. Red ones, I guess, are 200. And that opens a path back, I guess. I don't know why you'd want to do that. Um, oops. Red dude. Touch it. Red dude. Blue dude. Pink dude. Then green dude right here. Call them all over. Pop, pop, goes the weasel, and we go through the door. 
Yeah, that was just uh, a couple of lanterns. Oh! Game Boy Advance screen. You've plagued me. Why, why, why would you betray me? How could you do this to me? Am I supposed to go like on here? Yeah, yeah, and that's a little warp portal there. And I'm back up here. Let's see. Where am I? Ah! Traps all over the place. I'm being betrayed by trap doors, and I can't tell where the heck they are on the screen. And we're back up here once again. Can I tell where the trap doors are? Oh, no, I can't. <laughs> Uh, so that's kind of a problem, isn't it? Scoopers, scoopers, kill these things. I don't, I forgot the names of them. I don't really care, as I said before, I'm not about the details. I'm about the, um, the gameplay tips. Oh, shoot, I'm just dying all over the place. I could use some help, actually. Yeah, there's a force gem, though. There's two paths to take. I'll take the north one. I don't know if I want to take the north one or not. Uh, is it, oh, there's a dead spirit here. Oh, I have friends. Oh, poor ghost guy. You could find friends in your other world. I believe you could. And I can throw my buddies. Oh, really? Oh, I can pick you up and throw you across there. And uh, yeah, I'll get this ring. It's a blue bracelet and now it's reduced by half our damages. It's the bow. Yay. And uh, for some reason, oh, I lost the lantern. Oh, poopers. Um, I really hope that doesn't screw up the camera as I go. But, uh, well, whatever. Oh, there's a... Oh, I needed to shoot the switch that was over here. Can I just shoot it across here? I'm pretty sure there's a switch. Oh, there we go. <laughs> uh, does that open this door? No, it doesn't. Okay, let's just go back down here. Uh, I don't know why the characters are kind of glowy. Because the whole screen is pretty bright. Oh, pooper is really dark screen. Uh, let's go to vertical formation and break our way through here. There's a whole load of pots. And, oh, boy. You can block those up that fire with your sword swings or... Um, or by just with your shield. And where am I supposed to go here? Uh, oh, I guess up here. More pots. I couldn't see there was pots there. Dang it. Perhaps I should have came in here with the um, lantern first, but I got the sword. Oh, poopers. Let me um, grab the key and get out of here. I'm getting slaughtered by the fire. Ah, run. Run, Lynx. Run. Ah, fire. Hot. Run for it! Oh boy, oh boy, let me... I'm just gonna go into one player mode. I shouldn't even be in a different, like, character mode. The door is... There we go. Now the camera should be uh, still messing up, but better. <laughs> um, so I guess I'll have problems with just these areas, if anything. So, skip, skip, so I guess skip these parts if you uh, care about those sort of things. Um, you'll see that there's some flames here, and... Uh, yeah, just shoot your fire through it like so. And you'll be able to light the lantern like that. And holy poopers, a load of bats. And you can kill them using your bow and arrow just by shooting a load of arrows in your horizontal formation like so. And I would recommend that you do so for force gems because that's pretty awesome, I gotta say. And I'm gonna go to horizontal for the rest of these guys. Woo! And woo! I could use those, actually. I'm up to 1,478. How the heck do I get those two floating above there? Will I get a boomerang or something? Anyway, the screen is nice and bright again, so that makes me very happy. Uh, so, yeah, I'm... Wait, I'm back again? I'm not back again. Uh, unless... Uh, for... What? For Link... Maybe I'm, you know, from Link to the Past or something like that? Wait, what are you talking about, girl? Oh, no, I must have taken the wrong path. I guess this is one of those, uh... Um, you must choose your fate sort of dealio paths, and let's just see what the puzzle is. There's probably a solution to it somewhere, uh, or I'm just supposed to guess. So I know that bottom left path was wrong, so let's try the upper right. I guess the upper right one was the correct one. So, upper right first, and oh, five force gems, wow, that's like, it's pocket change. What do you got to say? Uh, hee hee, what? Uh, I'm gonna take the left path, so... Oh, that was right, so upper right, then left. I can live with that. 50 force gems and 100 for the win. And... Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. I'll take the left one again. Oh, I was wrong. I failed. Let's try it again. Upper right. Then it's going to be upper right again. Well, just the right path. And then I got to choose the left path. Oh, wait. Oh, poopers. Why did I do that? I knew better than that. <laughs> wait, 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 wait. Wait, what? Did I complete? 
Did I? What? Who? Okay, maybe I forgot where I was supposed to go here. Okay, upper right. And it's. And it wasn't upper left. See what I mean about my memory? I'm horrible with that sometimes. And I just played this too, so now I gotta go up this way. And I think this is it, because this is stairs leading up. Yay! And there's a dead guy here. I'm sorry you died, guy, but uh, don't worry, I will escape alive. And I will press those, or grab those switches with the R button. R button for the win! Eh, eh. Oh, but that failed. So let's go into vertical formation, and let's pull each other, and now we can move the switch. That's another one of the puzzles to this game, is that you have to... Yay! Oh, I bet you this one's a trap. I bet you this one's a trap. It's probably gonna block, or plop some snakes down from the ceiling. Or give us force gems, one of the two. Oh, it's a treasure chest. I'll take that. Yay, it's a heart. I don't really care about them. Well, I guess I do kind of care about them, but you lose them at the end of the level, so... Oh, I got a channel link! Take him down! I will defeat you! I will defeat you! Yeah! Ooh! You! You! Yeah! Your mother! Yeah! Ooh, ha, take this! You're you're going down! You sucker! Oh, uh, yeah! Ooh, yeah! You better not mess with me again! He's gone. Oh my goodness! He's changing colors! You must use the correct colored link to defeat him! I remember that much. Yeah! And now he's throwing bombs! Poopers! Yeah! Take that, you sucker! And he's dead! Let's... Oh my god, I just... I made an earthquake! Oh my god, it's a cave in! Oh, no, he's safe. Ugh! Stop scaring me like that cave. I guess because it's a cave of no return, it just frightens me a little bit. Well, anyway, let's just check around here. What you got to say, dude? Oh, oh, the poor guy. He got killed by Shadow Link and all... Oh, man, what's in here? I could use some more force gems. I'm coming to the end of the level, I would guess. I don't remember, actually. It's I'm 17 minutes into this. Oh, poopers! I am at the end of the level. Well, if you ever come here and you don't have enough force gems, you have to restart the level or go back to go uh, get some more force gems. Um, like, if you try and swing your sword at them right now, you, you kind of fail. Yeah. <laughs> So I need more force gems. So what I'm going to do is play through the level again off camera and uh, travel back in time to get those force gems that I need. I believe um, when I get enough force gems, I'll be automatically warped back over there. So I'll just hold on a sec, please. And there we go. <laughs> yeah, that's basically how it works. When you, get, when you get enough force gems and you reach this room, when you have enough of them, you are able to just warp back to this room. How many Force Fairies this time, I would guess? Oh, I got uh, two Force Fairies for that. Well, that's four lives I can use to continue levels if I need to. And that about does it for this part. So I hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll see you guys in the next part. <gasps> Toodaloo! We'll be doing, um, uh, yeah, yeah. well, whenever it says the name. <laughs> uh, yeah, we'll save the game, thank you very much. Let me... Read the name so I can say Toodaloo. Yes, I will continue playing. Oh, it's just it's just titled Hyrule Castle? It really is? Oh, okay. Next part, Hyrule Castle! Toodaloo!